what is up guys I am playing some Skyrim I am gonna show you the first dragon that you fight but first let me talk about a little bit about the game and my little bit of impressions so far in the game man this game is simply amazing I mean Jeremy soul the guy who makes the music for all the oblivion I mean all the Elder Scrolls games uh, Guild Wars ring a bell amazing music um, I mean, there's so many changes that they made to the game where you don't, when you talk, first of all, when you move, you know, you don't move sideways and awkwardly, you actually feel like you have weight to your character, look at that, and the graphics on the character, the detail on the character is amazing now, look at that, when I am, I mean, in the third person view, I like the third person view now, I actually use it a lot more because I like to see my character, and I like the way they move. It's awesome. When you talk now, you you kind of stay still and you can move around the camera. And it's pretty good. Pretty good. Instead of it zooming in onto the face. Um, I didn't really like that much. But anyways, the dragon will appear over here somewhere. We're going to the tower. I went back on a save so I can show you guys. This game is simply, I mean, look at the graphics. I don't even have, like, the best graphics card, but it runs smoothly. Maybe because I have a good PC, not necessarily the best graphics card, but the, a really good PC. But, I mean, a, re a good rest of the parts, I mean, um, like the RAM and the, and the processor. But anyways, this game is pretty damn good. If you're looking for someone to tell you to buy it go by it it's really good now we see the damage of the dragon over here next to the tower he went all crazy okay. all right oh i think i went a little bit too far she's actually talking here. got to figure out what happened and if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere spread out and look for survivors we need to know what we're doing all right and now we will shall look around because the dragon is still lurking close by and it will come and kill a couple people let me here let me just tab and oh yeah you can it's really really easy it, it gets some getting used to at first but it is relatively easy you just right there I'm pretty sure I can have a hotkey yeah favorite I think there's a hotkey so I can actually switch to the bow and my sword and everything on the fly so stuff me have to go to the tab but yes there's some from what I see there's some bow action two hand weapons there's some one hand weapons axes swords so many stuff magic dual wielding magic dual wielding swords it no, is amazing I was like wow are you kidding me everything the perks are amazing there's so many perks in each weapon like one hand two hand each magic there are perks let me just show you that real quick all these all you all those stars you see in the back are perks i could not believe it i could not believe it but let me get back down to business and show you the dragon what people are so wild about should be coming soon um, oh there he is. You see him? A dragon, an actual dragon. Now, what I did to beat him is I used the bow because getting close to that dragon, he spits fire right into your face. And it's just like, it, it will dump your, your health, like, really bad. Did he land yet? Okay. All right. Oh, no, he's going to land in front of me. Oh, oh my goodness. All right. It's best to stay near the tower so you can actually... Um, it's good to get him to land. So you get on land and you get him to land and then you back up because he will start spitting fire. And you just keep shooting him over and over with the bow. And he will start taking damage. Oh, it's good to cock it back. I'm not cocking it. Back. I'm sorry. And... This guy's using some type of magic, which I do not have, which will probably be better. Magic will definitely help you to defeat it a lot faster. And you 
gain levels for everything in this game. Every weapon you use, it makes, you, it makes the level go up. See, he's just going to keep coming down, and you can shoot him with, with um, your magic. If you're a magic user, you can shoot him with your, with your arrows like I'm doing. And it is a piece of cake, really. I mean... It, it, it takes a little bit of just a little bit of time but not too much and he just threw a fireball at me and I'm burning ouch 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 and and he is almost dead there we go congratulations guys you defeated a dragon and we're just gonna go up here and see some awesomeness get owned son get owned and I am just gonna take everything here but I went back on a save for you guys. Here we go. Everybody and now, the best part. We absorb the energy. The power of the dragon. Isn't that awesome? Isn't that awesome? And before, you actually learn the actual, um, like the first part of the word, and now I can actually use it because before you're not able to use it, you go to tab, magic, shout. Because right now I'm going to use it. I equip that sucker. Um, did I just forget how to equip it? There we go. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. That's how it works. All right, and it's on Z, and now they're going to come up and actually staying next to me I can't believe it you're dragonborn yes I am in the very oldest tales back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power that's what you did isn't it absorb the dragon's power seeing you get a, a good view of actually how you talk now and you can still move around I'm pretty sure on Xbox you can use your analog stick to move around. Here you you just like go on the corners of the screen, go up and down, and you can still talk. I love this way much better than Oblivion way uh, and Fallout. There's out. only one way to find out. Try to shout. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? As you see, that's the first, first syllable, I guess you could say. It's not the full shot. And if you stay here, you actually talk to them and they start talking about the dragon boys and all that stuff. So I'll let you guys do that. I love my hoods. Love my little hoodie in it. There she goes. You must be one. You say you're left. You're being awfully quiet. Come on here then. Tell us. Do you believe in this Dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. She doesn't about. believe in the holy power. Here's a dead dragon. And that's something listen to this. I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical Dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Oscar. You ain't at all. All across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting what you just did. Must be. You really are Dragonborn. Alright, that's it. That is some dragon gameplay for you. And I hope you guys like it. Like the video if you like it. And that's it. I'll see you guys later.